What's up, everybody, man? What are we doing here, man? What are we really doing here? What are we doing here? It's total slaughter and chill tonight. Episode one. Y'all remember Total Slaughter, right? Go back, I think, 2014-ish. June of 2014. Used to come on Fuse TV on Wednesdays. They ain't never had a friend like me. Believe that. And we're going to get into it, man. This was a very interesting um, concept. It was. It's basically battle rap and real world, you know, merged into one. That's what we have here. So, and if you go back, what do we have? Like, eh, it's about been about five years since the uh, first episode happened. And, you know, I thought it was really cool. It brought a lot of, it brought a lot of attention uh, to some of these guys. Uh, I'm sure a lot of people uh, found battle rap from this, from this series. You know, it was a good exposure. If you, if you're familiar with the guy, Joe, you know, the battle rapper, Joe, he became a battle rap fan and then a battle rapper um, after watching Joe Budden in Hollow the Don. Hence the name Joe, I'm assuming, because he was a huge Joe Budden fan. You know, there's a few out there. There's a few out there. But um, I thought it would be fun to go back and, uh, you know, relive these episodes. And maybe a lot of y'all haven't seen them. And um, I think it's going to be fun. So let's check it out. This is Eminem's Shady Films Presents Road to Total Slaughter, Episode 1 of 4. So there's four episodes, and it's going to lead into an event with the infamous Joe Budden and Hollow the Don, Murder Mook and Loaded Lux Part 2. Epske, what up? I saw your tweets. I've been there. I've been there. Um, uh, 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 Daylight and T-Rex. Big T and, what was it, an Arsenal? I don't know, but let's get into this, man. What your video right now about Romeo? What you what, what Roberto? What? We're not talking about that guy right now. It's right tonight is total slaughter and chill. Let's do this by an uncompromising spirit of competition. Today, nothing embodies that spirit more than the culture of battle rap. Yeah. Where have you come? I have twenty-two million. Now, eight world-class lyricists facing off in the ring, fighting for their chance to compete in the largest rap battle event of all time. I'm just ready to slit someone's throat. This calm down, Diz, calm down. We're already getting crazy. Total slaughter. Oh, you're watching my video. Yeah, it's a good one. It's a good one. <laughs> all right, let's do this, man. What do we got here? Mark 188, world-class battle rappers. Arsenal. Murph. If YMF was watching this, how many of the guys do you think he'd know who they were before the name popped up? Out of the eight, you think he'd probably know maybe three out of the eight? What's the high? What's the higher low on that? Three out of eight, four maybe. Daylight. They know this because Cassie. Mark one, you wouldn't know that. Math, yeah, maybe you know red. Maybe you don't know who math is. I don't know. Just saying. Team boot for team luck. These are the worst judges ever. Slaughterhouse judges. Royce, Buttons. Crooked Eye, Ortlis, Joel, Joel, whatever, Ortlis. Okay. These guys can't, they don't, no, they ain't it, man. These guys were not good judges, man. Joe Button's a troll, you know, so it's like, how do you, you know, let him judge anything? DJ K Slay. Let's go, let's go, man. All right, I haven't seen these in forever. Eddie got a lot of history. Feel free to talk about it. Let's talk about the history. Brooklyn, New York. 452. Brooklyn in the house. So math didn't have to go far, huh? Math didn't have to go far. Nobody raps like me. You can't rap like me. Disaster. Falling would not be cool. I'm the best nigga in the house. Let's line them up, knock them down. All right, bro. I'm Arsenal. Rap yeah, vegan, yeah? This is what I was born and raised in. Arsenal. What up? It's the incredible Marvin Wonderful. Detroit. World famous fat fucking killers. I can out rap. Okay, Cortez. Ain't no rooms down here, though, right? Yeah, you can sleep on his couch. Nah, I ain't got that. Remember that. Everybody remember that. I got the natural presence. Big T, man. Oh, Big T has the natural presence. I'm concerned with making an entrance. I am an entrance. Awful. 
goat. That's not hollow. I mean, he's close to the goat. Kill us. I do not feel everyone here is on the same level as me. Jay-Z tweeted about, you're going to get this work slogan. It's very overwhelming moment, right? It's surreal. It helped out the culture a lot, you know? When people shed light on what we do, it was just really fun. The epic Jay-Z tweet. Um, I think they overplay that tweet a lot. Like, I don't think it was that, like, you know, monumental. I mean, I get it. I mean, it's just a tweet. Um, Jay-Z's watching, you know, maybe you, you hold Jay-Z to a very higher standard. I mean, I know he's a, he's a, you know, he's a legend and all that, but I mean, I don't know. I really don't care about stuff like that. I really don't care about stuff like that. One of those. I don't play games, A+. Plus. I just, just go! Life changes. Oh, what's up? Let's you. Come on now. Murder Mook. Love him, hate him. It's, mur it's Murder Mook, all right? Show some respect out here. That's Mook. You don't have to like him. It's Mook. I had the best interest today. And when the best interest is the best interest. I'm here. I'm on the ship. And we're going to rock. And we're going to sell out. Sell out, sun god, in the building. I'm definitely looking forward to mentoring these dudes. You know, give them a couple pointers since I've been around for a while. Hey, plus, I've been live for like 15 minutes, bro. I played a whole Pac song. What are you talking about? There's a rewind button. Use it. What's up, yo? We all get in the house right now. This is Mook. Daylight's still not in the house. I'm sure he's someplace planning some stupid stunt to pull. I'm the only battle rapper who thinks what a tactic. <laughs> Daylight. Okay, I don't Daylight. care about that. I'm doing whatever I want. Cool. Nice. Great to play the French toast. That's what I'm going to do. Throw everybody's off. Daylight's gonna come with the antics. I thought this was about rappers, and I don't know if it's about strippers. <laughs> man, they don't do this shit. Yeah, that's yeah, that Cali like, shit. Uh, he 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 own state, bro. You gotta pray for daylight. Something right with that boy. She drinks out the pitcher. You know what I'm saying? Just to, just to be rude and, and disrespectful and different. Who bears these? Come on, It don't matter who bears these is. My bitch. Man, they like shit. My bitch. This nigga's weird, though, bro. As a man, all I feel like, bro, don't bring that shit around me, bro. That's why I got, if you coming in the room, I'm going to leave the room. If you ain't in there, make it. They say, when you going to get closer to your enemies, you got to look and act like them. So I showed you I'm not like them. Throwing some clothes so I can blend in with these suckers. I mean, I'm, I'm actually grateful as far as... So you have, you know, you, so putting on clothes is making you blend in with some suckers. I get the logic. You guys get the logic? I the coach is concerned for kind of feel like they like. I think he brings a lot to the game as far as his antics and different things that he does. But, you know, very clever nonetheless. People think the Joker is crazy. But he's... I mean, these tattoos are crazy, bro. Interesting. Yeah, it's really interesting. Uh, you guys are playing. I can't believe that you're content with being known for antics. I can't believe it. Get over it, bro. Marv one, you're taking it too serious, man. It's it's just it's it's it's, 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 it's a thing. It's a thing. Now I don't agree what he does here in the actual battle. Um he could I mean he could have done the first two rounds exactly what he did, but we'll, we'll get there, we'll get there. The third round is where he dropped the ball. I, hear the rap. No. I told y'all I'll be the most talked about in battle rap within a year. And a year later, I'm standing right here. What are you here. being recognized for? For being oh. naked and it's I'm, like in a tattoo? Like, I'm, 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 hold on, hold on. So everybody's giving daylight shit for, for his antics? Is that what this is about? People just don't know how to have fun anymore, man. They, everybody's just so uptight and takes everything so serious. Everything is just so, God, you know, just, ugh. We're all going to die soon, man. Just just have fun and relax and and laugh at yourself. And don't take all this too serious, man. It's, is it really, like, that deep? Like, really? Who's more popping, Daylight or Cortez? Or Daylight or Marv 1? I'm just asking.
None. I the it's Corey. I'm not here to be buddy buddy with nobody. I'm here to do business, get these bars off, and not waste my time. Here's my. Okay, here's my How'd that work out for you, Cortez? On this show, how'd that work out? Oh, I don't know. Spoilers. Balance. Here's my question. Do you feel you need the antics to? DJ. <laughs> Uh, were these around back then? Is that when the No Fly Zone song came out? Or uh, okay. Be popular. Yes. Yes. That's cool. Yeah. Up. It's very few are as popular as you've made yourself. Antics or not, that can actually write. That can actually rap. I was made you watch battles you wouldn't have never watched. Battle. Battle. <laughs> you gotta keep essentially why we do this, like the foundation oh, yeah, principle man. shit. Lux too, man. I was hoping Lux wasn't gonna get involved in this. Come on, Lux. Come on, Lux. Mook, you're not going to let me down, are you? Only because you got to have that because it's, even though we recognize as you using, you know, your mentality to put on a showcase, it got to be the fundamentals that it is. Like a lot of things we trying to push to get battle back to another level, mm -hmm. for those who's going to come behind you. Mm -hmm. I can't agree with any of that. I just can't. So you got to leave, you know what I mean? The, the key things, the central things. That's the salvation of the reason why we do it. I feel like battle rap is the salvation for hip-hop in a whole. We keep the world. That's a nice little, uh, you know, way of looking at it. Or you can just look at it as, you know, we're having some fun, man. We're, 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 we're battle rapping. We're, we're making money, doing our thing. You know, I get that there's a uh, da-da-da, and I mean, but I don't know, man. It's, it's just a lack of, of, of uh, a sense of humor. I don't know what it is. I think maybe within the last five years, battle rap has grown so much that I think it's just slightly below mainstream hip hop. You can make good money. Battle rapping is becoming a new genre of shit. My goal since a child was. I now, a little context. It's 2014. Two years uh, um, after Summer Man is two, I believe. And um, it was in a, like a little transitional phase here. I think the peak was Summer Madness 2. You know, 2013 was interesting. And then you had, then this happened. So, you know, we weren't where we are now. We're definitely not where we are now. So you got to remind that. We got to remember that in context here. I wanted to be a rapper. I wanted to travel the world and get paid for rapping. And that's what I'm doing. I can guarantee you get rich. Oh, no, you can get This rich. shit right here, right now, is, is, is hey, going yeah. hey, to get rich. I'm not rich, but I get paid. I got 18, 19 stamps in my passport, bro. You know all the UFC fighters you see? Arsenal's living his life. He got 18 to 19 stamps, bro. You know, happiness is, uh, is, is, is um, subjective. And individualistic. Now, you know, what makes Mook happy is not going to what make Arsenal happy and Cortez and Daylight happy. I think too many times we try to um, enforce what we think is happy on other people and expect them to go that route. And it's not a, it's not a good way to get through life. Right now getting millions of dollars. Yeah. And nine to ten years ago, bro, they were just like us. In the beginning, when they were already socking people out and they were known as... I'm going to keep on get even more A-plus just for that comment. Keep telling me what to do. The strongest people, they were still living, bro. You think the UFC fools were getting paid like that? Like now that? they're getting millions because the, the, the they get to blow up. Is that everybody doesn't feel they can be a UFC like, fighter. Really? Everybody in the fucking world they feels that they can be a fucking battle rapper. But everybody... <sighs> everybody that can be a US fighter, but everybody feels like they can be a battle rapper. But that doesn't mean that just because more people will try it, because it's, it's an easier get-in. Um... It's not a physical thing. Everybody thinks they could be a rapper. You know, look at me. I, I, I pretended to be a rapper for 10 years. I thought, and I did pretty good at it. I was pretty good at that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So, I mean, it all, you know, if someone's good, they're good. If they're not, they're not. I mean, the, the people will decide. I don't, I don't, I don't like this. I don't like these attitudes, man. The bottom line is they were at a point where they didn't have it and now they're millionaires and that's what's going to happen with us, bro. You, you just got to stick with it. It's a lot of tension in the house, man. Luckily, they, they got the chessboard in there so people could uh, calm their asses down. Bro, I thought you don't see that thing over there. What? Look, look at that room right there next to him, man. My favorite game in the world, chess. Cortez had beat me one summer evening. Come on. Let's go. Oh, yeah, I've had to get my rematch. Chess? It's like the most mental game there is. You guys, man. <laughs> I don't know, man. I'm just uh, being a hater. 
At this point in time, it's all about who makes the first mistake. I make a move. Make a move. Make a move. Make a move. And that was the first mistake. I don't, even want, I don't even want it like that. I don't even want it like that. That, that no. no, better than that. Yeah. I have no idea how to play chess. I'll be real with you. No idea. Never bothered to learn. Checkers always seemed a lot more funner to me. I'm a simple-minded guy. Of course. You know better than that. I don't even want it. I like the simple things over here. You beat me. You was one piece up. It feels good to redeem yourself, you know, coming off tough losses. Check me, Cortez. Check me. The tension is getting really thick in is here it? from all the testosterone and egos floating around. And Averb is right in the middle of everything, just adding <laughs> fuel to the fire. Don't nobody listen to me, but everybody watch you. Hey, hey, listen, that's, why, that's, why, that's why I'm number one. You guys are losers, not me. I've been winning since day one. You got 60,000 battles. I got 27. You got 27. Hold on, listen. I don't think you're He only has 27 here. This is 2014. I could have swear I just saw him do an interview. Five years later, he said something about he had about 77. So about 50 battles in, in that five-year span. I mean, that's a lot, right? 10, 10 a month? 10 a year? 10 a year. Yeah. You know how many listeners? Yeah, he's he nowhere near seven. Do you know how many this is, uh, this is Total Slaughter, uh, episode one. Battle rap meets the real world, basically. Um, and it's, it's a good watch, man, if you've never seen it. A lot of legends. These are legends. These are legends. This is basically an archive of legends in a house. Like, um, I, we, this needs to be appreciated a lot more. Like, this is this never happened again, and it, it's it's fire. If you had, and these are all legends. Like, literally all of them. Uh, you dub. Twenty-seven. Why well, you got your mind? You the view? I had eight million views when I took you. Bruh. What are you talking about? Humble yourself. I'm at 22 million. You have 60 battles. I got 27. Let's chop in the head. Tw oh, I'm sorry. 27. 22 million, 27 battles? When you got the, the, the cooler rapper, you know, he always gets treated the worst. Ain't that right, Mark? You don't even have the credentials to address me, credentials. bro. Credentials? Credentials, bro. You shouldn't even be talking directly to me. Now, now, now Mark, you, now you, should, you should have to talk to a nigga to talk to me. Now, Mark. Strange ass Mark, one next door to me. You know, we gonna work through that, though. This is gonna be exciting. Y'all should battle first for sure. Man, you can't even talk, man. I put a bullet on you. People were mad they paid to see you, bro. That is People walked away mad because they were paid to see you. You? Please. <laughs> I put that on everything I love. Nobody in the venue was impressed by what Nobody. you did. Only, only my haters got on your side. Don't mistake them for yeah, the fans. Well, it thing. took him the first well, round to half the round to be like, a condom break. I'm a pond in this. Listen, listen, listen. A condom listen. break. Did it's I, the most listen. fucking did simple I, shit I've ever heard. Hit that like button now. You guys are We are young sir. He's a legend. This is my first time being in the presence of me. He's like an OG to everybody. He supports the underground scene, the battle rap scene heavily. DJ K Slay. Mixtapes. Yo! Fellas, what up, son? The motherfucking drama <laughs> king in the building. What up? What's going on, fellas? Everybody good? Welcome to the house of slaughter. Hope y'all got the settle in. The House of Slaughter, <laughs> I guess. Uh, it's a little corny, but I guess. We got Loaded Lux here. We got Murder Mook here. I got a couple of ladies I brought through. Basically, the night is all about y'all. You know what I'm saying? Going to kick back, relax, have a good time. But tomorrow, the slaughter begins. Let's get it popping, y'all. Ain't never too late to do this. This ain't a fucking party pack, man. Oh, what are they doing now? What are they doing now? Who's this? Who's this? Very nice looking Hmm. Which one? You got you can only pick one. You can only pick one. I like her, man. I do. I don't know. Looking like Coke bottles. We're all in the house, and there's a level of camaraderie. But at the end of the day, we're here to see who's the best. Hello, man. I don't know. Okay, you know, that's a little different. I like that. It's still a competition. We all know it's go time tomorrow. Hard work, and that's what I do. Big T today had a good time. Ha, smiles. For tomorrow, there's no time to play. I'm the last person to go to sleep. Because while everybody's sleeping, I'm working hard. They paid me $38.58, man. 
That's it. That's all they gave me to do this. I was desperate for the money. Oh, God, Joe Budden. Here we go. Be prepared for it to be Joe Budden. Wake it on up. Wake it on up. I can be just as grumpy as him. Trust me. Game time, y'all. Game time. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Game time, y'all. Good? I can wake up to these celebrities. This shit is really happening right now. Good. Right. Good. Right. 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 What up? What up? What up? What is this shit? What is this shit? They got the two fat niggas in one room. What up? What up? What up? I said, yo. Yeah. When we get to the Joe Budden hollow battle, man. Joe's tough, man, to listen to. Real shit. Why we are here. It's 80, it's 80, you guys. You I mean, just think about all the battlers. All the earned your spots oh, here. The four of us. All the battlers and then these guys, man. I mean, Joe's a quasi, you know, legend. You know, like, like a top tier rapper. You know, Detroit legend. Crooked Eye's a, a West Coast legend. And, you know, Art Lee's, he's, you know, he's, he's good. Will be the judges for the tournament that's going to take place. It's two brackets. The two winners will co-headline the main event. The first round of the tournament actually starts tonight. So I'm seeing the game faces. I hope y'all bring them balls. Matter of fact, we got something cooked up for you. Hey, move. Slaughterhouse. So right now we sitting down with Slaughterhouse. We in the room with Legends, you know. And then everybody's repping their city. I see the Red Wings. He's got the Blackhawks on. New York. Nobody. You know, but everybody's being down with the home team. I, I feel. I feel you. All of a sudden, Moo come out of here. I usually don't sweat like New York. that, but I'm interested to see what Moo got to say. Nobody's perfect. I had fun last night, but uh, Harlem I shirts. Just go to sleep without inviting my man to the party. You already know who my man is. Don't do what I think you're gonna do, Mo. That better be up for the shit. I need y'all to please welcome T Rex. What the fuck are you wearing? Another goat, bro. Another legend. T Rex Belly Season One. Have you guys seen it? <laughs> Double damn, man. I'm from Harlem, man. <laughs> Like, what up? Your boy T Rex repping that Harlem more dot mark thing. And I came here to dominate and show wearing. everybody what I'm about. He gets to pick one of you guys to battle right now. That? The loser is out of the tournament. What? And has to sleep on the couch. Well, here we go, the infamous couch battle. This is it, the infamous couch battle. You want your bed. Button's from Jersey, right? Fit, yeah, you're right. Because Rex point. had it all night to choose who he wanted to battle. You see, Button's a weirdo. What's he gonna what's Jersey got? The Nets? The Jets, the the Devils, the Devils is cool. I like the Devils. And none of us had time to prepare. Some bullshit. Rex make people nervous, man. I don't really even blame him for it. Like you just unleashed a human pit bull in a meat market. I'm just glad he on my team. You gotta pick him, man. If you come in and pick the weakest person, then that makes you the next weakest nigga in the house. So if you come in and take a nigga out that that niggas look at in respect. Then they're gonna look at you with respect, like yo, he came here not to joke. I see the comments. <laughs> I can't just not gonna, let me watch. Okay. <laughs> let me watch. <laughs> What's going on here? Can you imagine? I can't feel because I got someone else depending on me, and that's what makes me go so hard with this music. And he paid attention to the battle, so I'm taking him even more serious now because I know he's watching. So having a son makes me a better battle rapper. Loser gotta sleep on this shit. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> wow. So we go into this crazy ass vibe like some back in the day shit. I'm right back in this grimy basement. It's one light, brick walls, it's dusty. It's hard to breathe because there's so many people in this small space. It's gritty. Everybody just didn't hear bumps. No Murder Ab Gang. No Murder Ab no Gang hat. Right here, Cortez. The fashion the was different back then. T Rex on the right. This joint gonna be one round, 90 seconds. Stretch. Call so, small. so loser sleeps on the couch. Cortez versus uh, T Rex. Interesting, interesting battle. Who's gonna win this one? Can we rewrite history? Tails never fell. 
Hey. Tales never fail. Can we get any more cliche than that? Cortez usually snatches the corn out, out the air and go first. When I said he didn't do that, I knew he wasn't too sure about his rhymes. Yeah. You ain't even hardcore. You don't even go in the category of hardcore. All right, hold on. Let's get going here. Let's rewind. Like, like yes. All right, we got a battle here. Yes, this, okay, that's, what, that's why we're here. That's why we're here. Let's go back. All right, that's let's enjoy the this. Out the it's T Rex right first. here, baby. When I said a legend. He didn't do that, Respect him. I knew he wasn't too sure about his rhymes. Yeah. You ain't even hardcore. You don't even go in the category of hardcore. I can have niggas putting hands and feet on call. Once he start rapping, they'll be clapping like an encore. This is what happens when you put Attica against Job Core. <laughs> Quit rapping, get you a Job Core. I can give you a weak left or a strong <laughs> right. And this battle shit is only the weak left. I done killed the strong right. I'm Tango. I went best in the show. Had every dog fight. My niggas will run up in beer cans because core is light. You ain't gonna chill <laughs> nothing and let nothing die. I ask niggas in my Oh, do they got respect for you? Nah, because you work at the airport. I mean, you don't let nothing fly. I mean, you might always change your last name to Lopez because when they find him, it's a Lisa bullet that was left in his eye. Oh, However, you want it, the black or the chrome gat. I'm on his block like we're Cortez. They said that earned cat. I'm like, yeah. All I gangsta shit he's talking, gonna get earned clap. No coffin. They put earned in the earned. That nigga earned that. Let him run. I got a scope and a red dot. Let him think he really got away. Then let that leg pop. Now, should I kill a gangster, show him the aim and give him a headshot? I'm aiming for his calves. I figure four, I make his legs lock. This nigga would be. Me? Look at Mook, look at Mook, look at Mook. You know I'm loving this right now? It's because they, I, I've seen this before, right? And some of these other battles... All. You can take this chain, but you won't die while you got it on. That map, I have a plan in the sky like Monster Ball. I kill his whole entire team. He better armor all. <laughs> Baby shotgun, I got it sawed off. Gage hit his shoulder blade. His armor looked sawed off, and it came with a knife on the front. I took the sword off. His head was laying right in the street. You saw it off. There it is. My niggas bought that action for that small talk. My killers move around without a leash like a dog park. Most of these niggas is suckers. I get them hauled off. Find them laying in the junkyard like a car park. Yeah. I don't give a fuck. If what it is, all right, mix, take, call whatever you want. All right, I fucking love that shit. I don't give a fuck what you want to call it. I love that shit. Like, fuck out of here. Hey! 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 Or what's gonna happen? What do you Rex has the advantage right now? I mean, for this to be the first episode and that be the first um, round that uh, that uh, someone would see, if let's, let's say you're not into battle rap, that you're new to this and you're just coming here, and maybe that's the first time you've uh, been exposed to battle rap, that's a hell of a way to get exposed right there. All right, fucking T-Rex, man. I got a few bars, a few haymakers that'll get him, so I just got to get him out, get my mind clear. T-Rex reminds me of the guy who's just having fun, and then Cortez just seems like he's overthinking it. That's how I'm thinking it. You know, I don't I don't live my life. I don't, I don't, just have fun, guys. Don't overthink life. It's all good. All right, you'll get there. And get through the 90 seconds. Going to ready? In here. Let's go. Oh, no, he looks nervous. Grown man bras. It's something you gotta do. Corny joke to start off. How big these man boobs get, Rex? Ain't gonna equal up to no real tits. <laughs> <laughs> nigga, oh. come on now, you know awesome. me. Finally, I got you. And I'm packing shit that's silver, nigga, but I'm snapping off the block, kicking shit like silver, nigga. Hold on. You the type to rap for the break? Hold on, hold on. Help me, guys. What the fuck is that? I mean, kicking shit like silver? Did I miss? I don't. I'm stupid, so I'm slow. Little. I'm a little bit slow, guys. So, what the fuck does that mean? Finally, I got you, and I'm packing shit that's silver, nigga. But I'm snapping off the block, kicking shit like silver, nigga. Hold on. You the type to rat for the bread to eat? Well, that's why you better roll, T. Oh, like, just notice forty. Like silver. Not. I thought he said silver. Uh, yeah. Okay. I know. I know who silver is. You're kicking shit like silver? Okay. Oh, he sounds like he says silver. You lost me. Hours. So don't owe T. Matter of fact, ball for ball, I'm, I'm killing this nigga. I know. Honestly, Anderson ball for ball, I'm killing this nigga. And that's how I feel, T. I just open doors and let y'all live. That's real, T. <laughs> that's nice. Hey, come on. All this preacher stuff gonna lead to preacher blood. Yo, math. How this remains in the blood in the tub. I'm gonna bleach the tub. Matter of fact, you come through. Turn it up. All this preacher stuff gonna mean you a stand up nigga. And since you snitching, you gonna need the crutch. Matter of fact, my soldiers <clears throat> roll in. I get your Caesar cut. I squeeze and buck on this virgin. Pussy, you ain't deep enough. Matter of mm. fact, like I said, fuck the preacher stuff in this preacher blood. I staff his remains. Come through, squeeze the blood. Mm. Matter of fact, hold on. Damn, I fucked that up all the way. No, 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 no. You choked? I don't remember. See, I've seen this, but I don't remember everything. He chokes? I 
I staff his remains, come through, squeeze the blood. Mm, matter of fact, hold on. Damn, I fucked that up all the way. I can't believe that shit. I ain't gonna choke though. Fuck that. I need that shit. Honestly, you look like your dad, Rex. And it's sad you mock him. Carl, your wind's low. Get it? I seen his daddy copping. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, fuck it, man. Damn, I fucked that up. Crazy. Hey. The fact that like, I choked and I stumbled, like, it got to me. You know what I mean? I don't want my little man seeing something like that. You only had like. When you choke, you got. And you get a freestyle. You don't tell us. Don't, don't. Don't, don't say I fucked that up. My, uh, you get, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, it's hard to, you know. But I'm just saying, you know. Who am I though? I don't know. But I'm sure your your peers will tell you the same thing. So. I don't know how much deliberating we need. play. <laughs> I mean, it's obvious. Even if you didn't choke, um, I got T-Rex clear, like beyond clear. You know, it went down. It's a slip up. Yeah, I, yeah, I think because of the slip up, no disrespect to nah, you, my brother. Good. We're going to have to go with T-Rex. Everybody no. clap it up for T-Rex. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, don't just say it's just because of the slip up. Let, let, let's have some context here. T-Rex legit won. All right, come on now. Like, like, oh, because of the slip up. Come on, Royce. You're better than that. Watching Cortez choke, it, it, was, it was hurtful. Cortez is a better rapper than that. All I was thinking is, damn, he got to sleep on a cold couch. So you have to break your bed down. Cortez and Cort Cortez, Cortez doesn't really choke like ever. I think I know he choked in um, England once. Uh, and, uh, I think maybe don't flop. And uh, it doesn't really have that many instances of him ever choking. Like so, it's kind of uh, weird that he did. And you're gonna have to set his bed up. You might have to go to his couch, my brother. <laughs> the couch. We need a bed for your jacket. Race came straight in. He was prepared for him, bro. It was crazy. Yo, I gotta bring out two quills for this shit. Like, for real. I need, I need that back, boy. I need that back. I need that back. I got two rounds. We don't know about the vault one's great point. The message that I gave to this house is do not. I'm assuming most of the vault, what I've heard of most of the vaulted ones are good performances by him, but, um, there could be a couple in there. Play with Rex. We ain't what, you, what, you, what you about to do? You about to take my shit? And he never lived this moment up. This is the moment cool that he has to hear about for the rest of his I career. Came to this house to the couch. Move to to yeah. Mook, how easy it was. <laughs> Yo. Yeah, this was this was Cortez. I need some sheets or something though. No. It's always dangerous though. As much as you know, can get a permanent ban on Pyro pancakes, please. Thank you. With you with Cortez, man. I, 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 yeah, cool you did what you had to do, right? This is this, it's no whole squad. All the partying and kumbaya stuff was cool, but if we didn't know that we were being thrown to the wolves before this battle, we definitely know now. We need battle on the spot. Now I gotta be on the couch. Like, this is really the jungle. Like it's it's kill or be killed for real. Tomorrow is a big day, and who knows what's gonna happen. All right, that's what's up. Do they have a do that? Even that my god given talent helped me lead a life. Uh, I'm good, my kept me even right. Yeah. See, this is more like the ladder. You can read the case. Uh, for every not choking here, are you? In the cipher. Now I can see the fights. I'm running wild, though. I had to stop. TNT, gun boys at a traffic stop. That guard stash box where I had the glock. Still afraid of heights, but somehow now I'm at the top. He could have just ran, he went into that, Cortez. To save face, I'm sure the judges aren't weren't, wouldn't have been aware of this because they seem lost anyways. 